People having stereotypes of us, of the younger generation and maybe a muttered word on a bus or something as somebody's passing by or sort of a dirty look, you know, um, and that's, that's really disheartening, I think, if somebody doesn't know you to judge you on, on that kind of basis of how you look or just your age group, really. You know, everyone's an individual and they've all got something to bring to us. We can learn from them. We may have life experience, but they've got skills, different types of skills that are beneficial to us that we need now. I think that you need sort of a, a mutual skill, some sort of focus for intergenerational work like this. You can't just put two people of different generations who may have different prejudices or stereotypes of each other just next to, in a room and say, you know, go, go and talk. Yeah, the, the focus of the IT helps to build other skills and experiences. I had trouble with Facebook originally on my tablet. Sophie sorted that out without any problem at all. She also taught me how to do copy and paste and the brightness level wasn't very good um, so she sorted that out for me and taught me how to do it and also put saving photographs so there's four things at least that I've benefited from today plus Sophie's company she's good <laughs> so I, that was really interesting actually it is enlightening because you learn new skills about how to communicate properly with lots of different sorts of people. Understanding that sort of patient, just that you need to slow down and, and talk things through to see it from their point of view, that's, that's really useful to the people that I've come in contact with. Respect is two ways, and you, you can't communicate with somebody if they're, not, if they're not interested or if they're not reacting to you and to the things that you say. You need to be able to have a, a strong sense of respect for somebody else because they haven't had the experience that you've had with technology or with anything. We've built up quite a good understanding really association between us.